of the Gal Girls. Minus one to snacking. Anyways, we're here to show you guys a super fun, family friendly Easter recipe. And this is so fun to do because we're making this for our church, which we love. Ah. And we love that this is going to be a great representation of Jesus. And we love Jesus. Yeah, it's That's true. in our hearts. That's right. He's in our hearts. Okay, so we're going to make what's called an empty tomb. And I think this is actually somewhat of a popular recipe. We've never made it before, so we are super excited to give it a go with you guys. So thanks for joining us, and let's get started. Okay, all right, actually I have to say, once I pulled them off the muffin tin, they look amazing, right, Ellie? Yeah. Yeah, let me show you. Um, maybe if you would have used regular marshmallows, they would have done better. All I had in the house was these amazing smashmallows that I personally love. My kids, my kids, I wanna say they, they like them, they don't love them, but that's what I had in the house, so. Anyways, let's check out one of our empty tombs. See if it's empty. Oh my gosh, it's hot still. Whew. Can you see the steam coming off that? Oh, it totally is empty inside. Thank you, Jesus. Can I see? Rising from the dead. Yeah, see? Look, it's empty inside. I don't see. Whoa. Whoa. Empty tomb. Because. Jesus is risen. Hey, can you girls all come say bye to everybody? Can you girls all come say bye? Can I have, can we each have our own? Yeah, well, they're still kind of hot. Okay, Sammy, you want to come say bye? Bye. Oh, see, Ellie, we can't see you. Bye. Bye. Sammy says bye, you can't see her. You want to do a quick little taste test? It's hot. Is it good? Mm -hmm. I do big taste. Oh, my Atlanta. Oh. Whoa. Hot. Hot. It's a little hot, but. Whoa. Good. That's really good. All right. We'll put everything we used and how we made them down below. So make sure you guys check that out. Thank you so much for watching. You guys are the best. We're so glad to have you here. I'm going to have everything listed down below. Don't forget to like this video. We hope that this blesses you as a fun activity you can do with your kids um, for Easter weekend, especially right now while the whole world is on quarantine and everybody's kind of stuck at home. Here's a great craft snack activity you can do um, that you can also talk about Jesus with. It's like a win-win-win. So that's it. All right. Peace out. We love you guys.